Well, hello everyone, it is Friday, September the 20th, 2024. I'm Doug. It's time once again to play some Wordle. And of course, it's Fearless Friday, which means we do a couple things for those of you who may be newer to watching the show. On Friday, we do two things specifically. Number one, we go into our settings and we turn on hard mode. Uh, which means we can't use like eval situations that don't involve letters already lit up on the board. And then secondly, in an attempt to make things even a little bit more tricky, we make it a point to use suboptimal starting words, things with like repeating letters, uh, unusual letters, things of that nature. And today uh, we're taking suggestion from XYZABC198, if that's your real name, uh, Fearless Friday word suggestion, Onion. Ah, delicious onions. I will admit, I do enjoy an onion now and again. Um, but hopefully, this onion won't make us cry. So here we go. Fearless Friday. Let's see if we can work our way out of this jam with onion. All right. Okay. So we got a little intel. Uh, we know that there is one in one letter O only. And it's out of position. So it's not in the first spot. So, you know, anytime you get any intel on a Fearless Friday is a good day at the office, if I do say so myself. So what I, the position I like to take with these is, in this situation, I can move that, oh, I have to move the O around, I don't have a choice. There's only three other places it can be. Uh, it's probably most likely in the second or the third. It's more likely in the second or the third than the fifth. So let's put really, really common letters around that O uh, in an effort to try and get more out of it. So what I immediately look at is the word store, uh, S-T-O-R-E, so we get to, to plunk four super, super common letters uh, around the O and see what we get. You never know. Could be. Could be. Uh, is the answer to today's puzzle the word store? No, it's not, but whoa, I saw the S and the O and the E light up in green. Um, we've been incredibly lucky this week uh, with, with, with the game, so for a Fearless Friday... To have three things in green, three letters in green on the second guess, it's a good place to be. Um, so, okay, now we got to close it out. Now, this is also like the, the – here's the thing. It's a blessing and a curse, right? It's almost like use the analogy of bowling where – You've only got two pins left to knock down, but it's the 7-10 split. And by that, I mean, there's probably a lot of different combinations of things we could do here. So before we celebrate too much, we've just got to get it, we got to get it, uh, uh, you know, figured out here. Um, so uh, looking at the second letter, um, swore doesn't work because we tested the R. Um, spore doesn't work because we tested the R. Spoke is a possibility. So there's spoke. Um, let's see here. Um, smoke is a possibility. So we get spoke and smoke. So maybe one of those makes sense because they have a common letter. Um, we have, we can't, we can't, we can't do sure because we tested the R. Uh, let's see. We slope. So you have slope, spoke, and smoke. So there's two types. Oh, boy, that's interesting, isn't it? That's interesting. So now uh, there's words that have intersection with the letters. So maybe maybe I think smoke makes sense because there's intersection between different possibilities here. So this is actually now looking like a pretty good idea. Um strategically i'm sold on and it could be the answer so uh let's see if we get super lucky peeling these onions here on fearless friday is the answer to today's puzzle the word smoke yes it is all right two days in a row um yesterday's was all luck this one was just kind of really realizing we had some optimal play on that second guess uh, and got there in good order. So, whew, again, we'll take it. We're doing good here this week. Um, so I uh, hope you guys are having a good time with it. Uh, again, let me know in the comments how you did. Tomorrow, of course, is going to be Saturday. The weekend is upon us. Uh, and, you know, we're not going to shrug off the weekend. No, because we're going to use the word shrug tomorrow. That's right. S-H-R-U-G. Uh, let's go ahead and get it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow with some more Wordle.